A trunk once owned by George Burns and Gracie Allen is just one of the many items on display in Curtain Call, an exhibition in special collections at the University of Arizona Main Library. We acquired vaudeville about two years ago, um, the, the American Vaudeville Museum collection, which is the basis of the majority of these materials. We also have the Frank Soren sheet music and the Arthur Wertheim um, collection as well that is being utilized for this exhibit. Well, basically, from the time that we knew we were getting the American Museum of Vaudeville collection, we knew we were going to do an exhibit with it. But we wanted to go through, see what we had, um, organize it, and then decide um, when would be the appropriate time. And because we kind of schedule our exhibits a year out, we already had a year's worth of exhibits coming up, so we had to wait till we had an opening. For this exhibit, it's called Curtain Call, and we're, we're focusing on about three or four of our vaudeville collections. And so overall, our vaudeville holdings probably come to about 100 linear feet of material. That's probably like 100 boxes worth of material. And so it's a lot to, um, to sift through and decide what we're going to utilize. In the vaudeville collection, we have three-dimensional objects, and one of them is um, a Coster costume, and it came supposedly from the Hippodrome in New York City. Um, it was saved when, when demolition happened, I think, in 1939. And it's a three-piece shell, or abalone shell, um, button suit that weighs probably like 50 pounds, and it is made for maybe someone five foot tall. It's a very, I mean, the person have to be very, very tiny, and the suit's very, very heavy. And, um, and I really like that piece. You know, people think of vaudeville, they think of big entertainment and, and the pizzazz and all that. And so we decided that we wanted to look at it from a more academic standpoint. So we started to look at different race, gender, sexuality, um, ethnicity, and how all these social factors kind of played into vaudeville um, and gave people a, a voice and a paycheck and so forth. 